Hi, this is Santi from Just Paint. Uh, we're just gonna introduce you to the Vibrant Press Face Powders. Um, this is a new palette that Anna and I created. Um, we search through many, many colors and powders and stuff, and we came up with this 12 color palette that we really, really like. Um, it has green, orange, purple, a shimmery pink, uh, shimmery blue, a light blue, um, yellow, light brown, white, black, dark brown, and a very, very awesome magenta. Uh, all the colors have a, uh, the palette has a magnet, so the colors uh, kind of stick, you see, to the, to the palette really nicely. You can still pick them out uh, if you want to just use them individually, but the palette will keep them nice and, and protected. And the palette has a mirror too, as you can see. Um, we don't have a red yet. Uh, it'll come in a couple months. Uh, we're still working on it. Um, so I'm going to show you now how they compare to other powders available uh, right now in the market, just so you can have an idea. Uh, this is the, the Meron uh, Intense Powder, so you can see the palettes are kind of about, you know, very similar size, though the individual colors on the Meron uh, are a little bit bigger. Uh, you can see them there. Uh, though we love Meron and I like this palette, uh, and, I and we love this palette too, I think that the, the, the colors we have on ours are a little more opaque, a little more vibrant. Uh, that's why we put that name, Vibrant. Um, but And you also get uh, only two, four, six, eight colors with the Meron Vibrant palette. Um, I'm sorry, with the Meron uh, Intense Powder, and, and you get 12 with ours. Um, you know, something like, for example, black, which is quite an essential color. You don't, you don't have it over here. And you do have extra two shimmery colors. So that's kind of like difference with the Meron Intense Fire. And the Ben Nye, I'm just going to show it to you. Ben Nye are all shimmery colors, so it's not really comparable. But I wanted to show you like the difference on the size uh, of a Ben Nye container and one of our uh, vibrant colors. I'm just going to pick it up from one sample that I have here open for you. So if you can see, yes, the Ben Nye, the Ben Nye uh, Lumiere's are a little bit bigger, okay? Um, but, well, it's a different product too. So these are shimmery uh, colors. Ours are mostly opaque. And of course, if you wanted to compare it with a uh, uh, star blend, ours, um, <laughs> you have, you can see that there's a big difference. But we'll show you what is the other difference with them. Not just the size, you know, yeah, it's a little bit smaller or quite a bit smaller than a Starlin, um, but you will see the coverage, uh, which is what I think make this powder stand out. So I'm gonna use my um, already opened and used uh, colors. These colors that I have over here uh, are the ones in the palette, and then I have these, these ones here, those are extra colors that we have right now uh, for sale, just individual colors. So you can make your custom palette or just buy a couple of them if you want to. Um, so what we're going to show you is, for example, the coverage. And I'm going to compare a Starblend Orange with a Vibrant Orange. So here we have a Starblend Orange. And it looks, it looks a little destroyed, poor Starblend. Uh, but still works. I put a pantyhose around it to keep it in there, but I don't take this out on jobs. We haven't like applied that. the Denise uh, yeah. Call method mm -hmm. yet to it. We will. I'm going to filter it through the pantyhose. So here I put some, and can you see my arm there? Okay. The oh, you can see the owie. Okay, well, can you see it here? Mm-hmm. Okay. So. Down more. Here. No, okay. just don't. Okay. So. You can see that's the Starblend, and now I'm going to use the other side of the other side of the smoothie to uh, apply our vibrant orange. So let me grab it. I can't do everything with one hand. So can you see it there? Okay. And that's our vibrant orange, and you can see the, how it keeps on going. Uh, so it, it's a lot more darker and I really think it, it does show a much much better coverage than than Starland. Uh, 
So if you need it to put more, you know, you can just pat it on and you'll see, uh, you know, you, it depends on how much, of course, you, pre you put pressure, how much pressure you put on and how much uh, powder you, you load on your smoothie, you get a better coverage or not. So I'm going to show you now, uh, we can compare, for example, the Starblimps blue with our blue. So I'm just going to clean a smoothie. Um, and we have these disposable smoothie blenders, we call them disposable, but you can still use it plenty of times and you can wash them out. So this is a star blend, the regular star blend blue. I'm just loading my smoothie over here. Um, can you see my arm here? Let me zoom up a little, yep. Okay, so it's just star blend, I'm trying to drag it, it doesn't really do much, so we'll pat it and then I'm gonna show you our blue this is we call it blue heavens can you see there mm -hmm. so as you can see it's like a much nicer shade of blue uh, it's like a more uh, I don't know. Tropical. Tropical, yeah, maybe. Kind of like Lagoon Blue from Paradise kind of thing if you had to compare it with another brand. Um, so those are just some of the colors I wanted to compare. Anna wants me to show you. I'll, and I'm going to be showing you right now swatches. So I just wanted to compare, you know, a little bit Starlings with, um, since are the most popular colors, with our vibrant colors. Um, Starling Green is another one that particularly not crazy about. I do like Starlin's like yellow, Starlin's red. So I kind of run out of uh, arm space, but maybe you can see it here on my hand. Not the best place to apply powder paints the hand probably because they're drier than um, most other parts of our skin. You know that the more oil a skin has, the more the color will stick to it. So now I'm going to apply ours. And you can see it's a darker, I think, richer kind of green. This is more like a swampy green, probably. Uh, so there you go, a comparison between uh, Starblins and the powders. And then what I'm going to do next is I'm going to have Anna put her arm here, and I'm going to show you uh, if possible, all the colors that we have available right now, so you can have an idea of how they look like. Uh, just, just give me one second, please, and we'll go back to that. All right, we're back. So we're gonna show you now. Oh, don't kick my palette. We're gonna show you now. Try to do it as fast as possible. All the colors uh, that we have on the vibrant palette. So I'm gonna start with orange. And that's orange there. And now I'm gonna try yellow. Cleaning my smoothie blender. Now the magenta, which is awesome magenta. Look at that color. Isn't that beautiful? I think it is. It's beautiful. All right. The green. Ooh. The blue. I'm just clean my smoothie on a just dry towel in between colors is the blue. Oh, mama. Now the purple. Is it true that we're waiting for even more colors? We are waiting for more colors and we're gonna have the, the full palette back in stock again pretty soon. Um, we're just waiting to get all the colors. Well, right now we have 10 individual colors uh, already available. Um, and we're gonna have more. 
pretty soon, I think it's two to three weeks, so if you guys are patient with us, we'll have them for you, uh, right for the super hot weather season, and these are great for like hot weather or really cold weather too, like when it's really cold, you might not want to put, you know, cold water on your on the kid's face, uh, so this is a great option, this is our, our black, and you know, we're going to try to talk a lot while I'm doing this, just so you guys oh. listen to something interesting. Yeah, but it's so interesting mm. seeing you applying the colors. Yeah. Um. So I'm yeah. going to try to put white now, and my smoothie, smoothie is kind of like already pretty gross looking. Uh, but no, no, let Don't me put it... Don't look at my dirty arm. Okay, let me put it next to the... There let me just load it well. That's the white, and then um, let's see. The last two colors of the palette is there. It's like a blue. You're gonna have to move the arm towards. Do -do -do. This I. This is my favorite. The shimmery blue. blue. It's so shimmery and opaque. I love it. It kind of compares to like um, the the new Fab London Sky Shimmer, mm -hmm. but on a powdery version. Mm -hmm. So and if you love that fab color, you're gonna love that one. I just want to say that and this is a shimmery pink. Ooh, that's a shimmery pink. I love this pink too. It's extremely opaque too. Um, a lot of people ask how it oh, compares to the Ben Nye Lumiere's. Okay. Lumiers. Can we get the other arm while you talk? This arm is covered in all oh, here. Maybe if I come from this way. Okay. This arm is covered in colorini. She has a covering colorini arm. So we're just mm -hmm. gonna do the side of her arm. Um, and what I'm going to do right now is going to be the colors that are not in our Vibram palette, but you can still get them individually and custom make a palette for you. Uh, so that's our teal. Uh, and now we're going to do the... This is like a royal blue. It's different than the light blue uh, that I swatched uh, previously. These palettes are a lifesaver on hot or really cold days. It's something that you don't always have to use, um, especially if you're economical, um, you know, and you're trying to save money. You can use your paints when the weather's good, and you can take out the palettes that's, when kids are melting. That's the goal. That's a goal, and as with any gold, you know, it's kind of harder to see uh, under, you know, on the camera, it's and really mostly the person is kind of like white skin, like Anna. Uh, I am purple skin. Yeah, well, it is very opaque though gold when you see it in real life. It's a copper. It's like Look a beautiful copper. coppery orange. Anyhow, what I was trying to say is this can save your life um, if you're trying to paint and all the paint starts melting off the kids. If you just grab the powders, you will uh, survive through any kind of crazy weather. Just the silver. So like what I'm trying to say is it's a great emergency kit. And if you well, and not only emergency yeah. kit. Like if you're painting smaller kids too, for example, or adults that want to feel like they're getting makeup instead of face paint. Look at that one. That that's one has a glitter. that's a pink purple, uh, sh um, frosted pink purple. That's yeah. the name of it. It's got little gold sparkles in it. Yeah, and this is the last one is a frosted purple. And you do want to be gentle when you're like rubbing your smoothie against the the colors just so you don't like put a lot of pressure in there breaking them um, so this is our, our shimmery purple uh, so th there you go you got all those colors plus all these colors no there's no way that's gonna show there you go oh my arms are breaking okay uh, so that's a vibrant palette guys um, Feel free to let us know if you have any other questions about it, uh, about the Vibrant palette or the powders individually or whatever you want to uh, ask us about. And just let us know if you buy it, how you like it, okay? All right, thanks so much for watching. Have a good day. Bye-bye.